Hi, welcome to the Fresh Press. In the time it takes me to finish making my coffee, I'm going to tell you a story. When I was younger, I sat at a lot of traffic lights. I still sit at a lot of traffic lights, but when I was younger is when this story takes place. My sister, Catherine, was uh, four years younger than me, still is again, and came up with this trick that fooled me for far too long. Every time we were sitting at a traffic light, she said, I can change the light. I can make us go faster. All I have to do is say, peanut. And she would say it. And the light would change. Usually within a couple seconds. And that was that was really impressive. She would just say, she explained it to us once, and then she would just do it occasionally. Not all the time, but every now and then, she'd sit there and go, peanut. Just quietly from the back. And then the light would change. And usually it was after we'd waited for a little while. We'd been waiting for the light to change, and it wasn't doing anything. And she'd say, peanut, and it changed. And this, this flabbergasted my young mind, because not only did it not make any sense, it was not possible, because you can't just say peanut and make the lights change, but she was doing it consistently. Not every time, but consistently. And she was younger than me, so she'd somehow figured out how to make these lights change by saying peanut. And that... That offended my young sensibilities as the older brother. I'm supposed to know these things. She's not supposed to know these things. But she did. Uh, and it took quite a long while of us sitting there. And, and she, she just did it, didn't say anything. It would, and, and the fact that she was so blasé about it always made me mad. Uh, because she knew something that I didn't know. And she was on, on to me. She knew some sort of trick that I didn't know about. And one day, I don't remember if I was just too mad, and I was, I was angry, and, you know, yelling about it. How do you do this? How do you, why does it work? I don't get it. And she would, uh, but eventually, either she told me or I, I broke down and figured it out on my own. What she would do is she watched from her perch in the back seat, from her seat in the back seat, she'd look at the other lights and wait for them to turn yellow, the green ones on the opposite side. And as soon as they turned yellow, she'd wait and she'd say, peanut, not loudly, not powerfully, just a little peanut, and then the lights would change, because that was yellow, and those would be green moments later. I've since tried it a few times on my own uh, with with little success. I still can't, I can, I can wait for the light to change, and then I say peanut, and it does change. I mean, that's, that's how they work, it's yellow and then green, but I can never seem to quite manage it with just the, with the regularity that she did it, or she had at times, she even knew how long the yellow light was, so she would say peanut, and the green light would change, uh, which is probably the first time I realized my sister, probably smarter than me, even at four years younger, and I, I believe that still holds true today. Well, I think my coffee is done, so I'm going to wish you a good day. I forgot my press. While I press this out, you have a great day, and remember to keep telling stories.